Hey, what's up guys? It's JB here again. Uh, today, I'm going to be showing off this uh, Saber Forge Venom. This is Pete's. Uh, originally, he sent me he sent this in to me uh, wanting a speaker change because uh, it was coming out really distorted. But actually, I found out it was the SD card. His SD card was, uh, was screwed up. I had to reformat it and everything. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't able to get his uh, original sound fonts that he had, but I do have the default sound fonts in here. Um, he, he's going to add his sound fonts as soon as he gets his, uh, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, we have uh, two black uh, momentary switches with the recharge port in the back. Uh, this kill key was made by Ethan Chesser, I believe. Uh, this is a really nice job. It's uh, I'm not sure what material it is, but it is. it's not plastic. The only piece that's plastic is the actual uh, plug that goes in. Um, got the blade plug that comes in with it. Uh, my dog opened a door. Um, so yeah, it has a... Uh, this is a Spark, uh, spark Color 2. Um, I had to do a rewiring of this uh, because there was no access to the Velcro chassis, if you want to call it. Um, by Saberforge. So I included a goth 3D chassis in here for the Spark Color 2. There's a 2 watt bass speaker in here. Um, that's pretty much it as far as that. Uh, let's turn it on. Pull the kill key. Get the response. Uh, I don't know what uh, what sound, sound font uh, it's on right now. So we got a purple color. It's pretty loud. We got a, a blaster fire and a blast a blade lock. So it's pretty cool. Um, it's really bright. Uh, pretty loud too. Um, you change the color with dual phase, so you twist the hilt like this. If I can get it right. There you go. Now it's a deeper purple. This is a red, green, blue setup. Uh, so yeah, now it's just it's it's getting it's going through the shades of purple right now. This is like a, a really really light purple. Now we got uh, the red mixed in with orange, so that's a uh, red and, and green. Now we got like a lime green color. Uh, doesn't really pick it up. It'll come out with a blade though, I'm pretty sure. And now we have a, a light blue. Almost, kind of, um, I want to say a little bit of cyan. And now we just have blue. It's still uh, mixed in with green. I didn't change, up the, I only changed a few of the colors for, uh, on here. And we're back with a uh, red, green, blue at once. And then back to the to the pink color. Um, so let me change a few of the fonts up. Of course, these are the default fonts. Father, son. Second font. Essence. Episode one. It's really, really deep hum. Uh, it's really loud. It's a clash right there. Go through another font. Hidden warrior. Warrior. I'm not gonna go through all of the little sound effects that it has. Just. It's called Meteor. 
I actually did not know how to work a Spark Color 2 uh, prior to this. Um, this is the first time I wire a Spark Color 2. Um, It's a little difficult for me to get the blade lock going. Then there's just two more fonts, and then it goes into Saber Tracks. This is the uh, the lime green color. It's a saber tracks right there, so it just plays the default music that's in there. So there's five fonts, I believe, um, installed. So he has, uh, he had uh, other like Hurricane and all that, um, but uh, again, I had to format his SD card because it was, it was really messing up this whole thing. I mean, the speaker, uh, I had thought it was a speaker as well. He he did too, but uh, apparently it was the SD card. Um, there was also a problem with the uh, the color configuration. Um, rewiring it solved the problem. Uh, the SD card, uh, if I went if I wanted to go into the color configuration uh, through through here, you know, pointing it down or whatever, pulling the the kill key, holding down the aux, uh, it wouldn't allow it. The speaker would just kind of make a little popping noise, and with the new SD card uh, formatted with the default. Uh, um, configuration settings it's able to work so everything is is back to how it was before and the only thing that that you need to do Pete is to install your sound fonts um, I'm pretty sure you know how to do that you told me you know how to do that so uh, this is going to be shipped to you on Monday um, so actually uh, let's put a blade in I almost forgot about that just so we can see the brightness of the blade. Um, this is going to be a little bit longer video than normal, but it's all good. So I'm not going to be swinging the blade around. I'm not. I'm not going to screw in the retention screw. I'm just going to show up the colors. So here is a very very light purple. It's like pink. So to change the color twist this so now it's a, a deeper purple it's really hard to tell on this I don't know I don't think changing uh, turning off the lights really helps I just really have to figure out how to change my uh, my camera settings it's getting lighter now now it's red or a blood orange now this is the lime green color. It looks white on on camera. Uh, if anybody has tips on how to how to get my ca my camera, I have a Logitech uh, Logitech. What is it? C six fifteen HD webcam. If anybody knows you know how to get a color, you know the way it should be. Let me know, please, in the comments. And this is a light blue, almost cyan. It's a deeper blue, but still with, have, with green. This is um, this is like a white, so this is like a silver color. <laughs> Leia, be quiet, please. And uh, we're here with the pink, and we're back at the purple. So, of course. All these colors can be changed in the configuration. Uh, I'm not going to do that because it takes lengthy uh, 
it takes a lengthy amount of time to do that. Pete will do this when he gets it. So I will be sending this out to you on Monday. And that's it. Laters, guys.